word on the street. So right now, Jay Prince Jr. is reacting to his dad, who is Jay Prince Sr., for getting honey from Brazy out of prison. Now, listen up, bro. I think this is a big move for Mubtaz. You get what I'm saying? Because, you know, we've been waiting for a very long time for Jay Prince Sr. You know, to make things right. You know, we've been waiting for things to go the way it's supposed to go. But at the end of the day, man, uh, it is what it is because everyone was calling out J Prince Senior, right? For not making things right for Honeycomb Brazy, for not making things right for, you know, for, for Brazy's situation because we know that Brazy was still signed on the Rap Along Records. And right now, these dudes who have fake securities, one of them is being released, right? He is free to travel for work, he is free to do whatever he want to do. So, uh, the internet was going a blaze, bro. They'd be like, what the F would they let him go and still hold Honeycomb Brazy, bro? But we understand that there was many charges laid against Honeycomb Brazy. So, you know, they wouldn't let Honeycomb Brazy go the way, you know, that dude went, right? Because, you know, in the first place, bro, the cars and the stuff that they found, you know, was not Honeycomb Brazy's, right? It belongs to these two fake ass security dudes and from the beginning we seen that they pleaded not guilty to that shit bro now jay brain jr is reacting he's saying that you know he probably you know helped honeycomb brazy send some money for honeycomb brazy when honeycomb brazy was still locked up and you know he let his dad know that they have to get honeycomb brazy out of jail and you know help him out and all that crazy stuff and he understands the situation of, you know, him and Honeycomb Brazy's relationship. It, it wasn't a good relationship, bro, for real. You know, Jay Prince Jr. being in a position that Honeycomb Brazy doesn't like him. I mean, Brazy doesn't like that dude, bro. Brazy don't want to have anything to do with that dude. But just imagine the situation where you are being accused wrongly, bro. There's some wrong accusations, but... It looks like the fans been watching Honeycomb Brazy for a very long time, bro. They've been waiting, man. They've been they be wanting Honeycomb Brazy to go back to prison. That's why they tracked him down in Alabama. And Jay Prince Jr. already knows that, you know, she was going crazy for Brazy. And he doesn't want to, you know, get into a physical altercation with Honeycomb Brazy or get into a crazy beef with Honeycomb Brazy. Probably he understands that the feds was watching Honeycomb Brazy all this time, right? And he decided to step back and not respond to all the deeds and all the all the fire shots that Brazy was coming for, right? And at the end of the day, man, they say that he's the one that helped, you know, Honeycomb Brazy, you know, he helped Honeycomb Brazy. He talked to his dad, Jay Prince Sr., to, you know, step into the whole situation. I think, um, allegedly, I would say allegedly, bro, this is still allegedly. That's the reason why the security dudes have to plead guilty for that, you know, for those gun charges and all that crazy stuff, bro. But we still have a lot of um, charges that have been laid against Honeycomb Brazy, man. Uh, so, crazy charges for real bro and there are some crazy charges against honeycomb brazy which is really crazy but at the end of the day man we know that honeycomb brazy is gonna be home by november right by november man he's gonna be home i think you know it's really fair now bro it's really fair now they say that you know he's being under their custody and they be having a lot of investigations and it looks like other charges that are laid against Honeycomb Brazy, they couldn't find him guilty for those charges, bro. That's why I've been telling you, man, that, you know, because they got charges against you does not mean that you're guilty of that, those charges. I mean, they have to go do some investigations and, you know, find you guilty for those charges before they can be able to put you in jail. So, you know, some dudes, some street dudes being be so overwhelmed with those charges coming from the feds but at the end of the day man uh even the feds can put charges on you and at the end of the day those charges might not be you know you know might not be real stuff like that bro because you know they have to investigate all that situation and you all know that jay prince senior fought uh had a, a case with the feds and he won right he won and came out victorious so right now 
you know, he's trying to get Brazy out of prison, right? Trying to help him out, you know, trying to make some make some things happen for Brazy, right? You know, maybe helping Brazy with the lawyer's fees and all that stuff, right? And letting those dudes know that they have to plead guilty because they are the ones that put Honeycomb Brazy in that particular situation in the first place. But it's still crazy at the end of the day. Remember, this video is for entertainment and educational purposes, so everything is allegedly. Don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification bell so you get notified whenever I drop a new video. 